Hello everyone, this is our Condor for the Commodore 64. It's an early Commodore 64 game. I've just been killed already. What you've got to do is get that arrow and use it to kill that... Well, it's supposed to be a Condor, but it looks more like a Greek mythology, some weird dragon thing. You've got to protect that baby. I think it's fallen off a cliff or something. That pink person there. Look what I was doing, but it looks positively obscene. By the way, do you see that cover art? And babies, it looks like a flipping horror movie or something, the kind of demon child. I think if I was being Condor, I'd be being terrified of that. Oh, do you think you're going with that? Oh, now it's flown off with it. Will you stop that, you disgusting little bastard? You'll ruin your eyesight, you will, you filthy little beast. Oh. Aiming that flipping arrow is just not very easy. Then maybe the trick is to make, wait until it comes down a bit and then just as it's closing in, you throw it. I've oh, got it that time. I've got you weird dragony whatnot, or whatever yeah, you are. Seriously, has anyone who ever programmed this ever seen a condor? And what all these blue things are running fast. Seems to be a couple of lampshades there for some reason. Well, it's supposed to be a beach or something. Dropped an egg. At least I hope it was an egg. There was a there's a fire there. I just walked into. Oh, done it again, you nipping weird green thing, or whatever you are. Oh, you need to see you're going with that. I'm actually capable of collecting an arrow. And this is all there is to this game. I mean, literally, level after level. Every level, exactly the same. Just protect that disgusting little sod. Throw the arrow at the bird. And Condor's supposed to be endangered. This game is literally encouraging the destruction of endangered species. Mind you, if you can call that a Condor, I'm pretty sure they're not green. Oh, jelly baby just flew up in the air, not quite sure why. Yeah, well this is worth it, I mean, for novelty. I mean, after about a few minutes it just starts to get boring. Nicer if they were being different levels, you know, different background scenery, that sort of thing at least. Not just the same level over and over again. Seriously, why doesn't he just I mean, pick the baby up and take it away? We can't find its parents, just take it to a blue crash or a police station or something and ask them to I mean, start looking for them. And while you're at it, phone a flipping animal handler. It's a bloody great bird here. It's been abducting people's babies. Somebody you do something. It's flown off with it again. I cried out about somebody called a coast guard or being bloke with a blooming tranquilizer gun or something. I'm not sure whether you can actually aim this arrow, to be honest. Oh, there are just so many stupid little things flying back and forth. It's difficult to keep track of them. Oh, missed it again. You sort of you just collect the arrow yourself, you stupid little thing bloody running backwards and forwards with it. I could have got that half the time. Why well, are there so many animals on this beach? Mind you, maybe it's a British beach. It means they're probably after all the blue rubbish and half eating burgers and bloody who knows what. Yes, thank you once again. What would I do without you? Buy a flipping dog, I expect. There we are, one roast condor coming right up. There's another species on the point of extinction. I think we better just leave it at that, because this game is just getting tedious now. It's not great for a few moments, but I mean, it's just, what is the point of it?